In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize your designer platform. Start by clicking on the designer platform icon, and if you have a designer account, you will see the screen that I'm looking at here, which we call the Manage Clients view. To customize the look and feel of your designer platform, click on the Settings tab. Now, notice here you can upload a logo for your website. Now, this logo will appear when you give your clients this link to log in and manage their site. So the link that appears up here is the, the link that you want to give to your clients as a designer so that your clients can log in and make changes to their own website. Now, of course, you don't have to give your clients access to make changes to their site you can make those changes for them if you'd like. So it just depends on how you want to operate your business. But if you want to customize this, you just click on this little uh, icon there and then you just choose an image, preferably 160 by 35 from your local machine and you can see that it's uploaded there. And here I can change the name of my business. So if I want to call this Pinwheel Designs, I can do that and of course I can update my phone number and I can choose whether to display my phone number uh, at this link or not and I can also choose to prevent my clients from changing their design. Now one of the things that happens is if you uh, allow your clients to change their design there's a chance that they could delete all the work that you did for them in which case they may be kind of frustrated about that so we have that set to no by default so clients can't change their design now up here we've got an option where you can change the URL where your clients go to log into their account I have it set up as manage but you could change that to edit or any word you want and then dot your actual website, or uh, I'm sorry, dot your domain name, uh, and then you click update. And those changes take about 15 minutes to take effect if you decide to go that route. And once you have everything customized the way that you like, click update, and your changes are applied. So let's just take a look at that. If you click on this link, you'll see that I'm currently logged in uh, to one of my clients. I call him John Doe's dashboard and editing his site I can log out of that just like that so that's the page that my clients would see with my little logo and my phone number uh, if they uh, came to that that uh, link and didn't have or weren't logged in so they can log in there so that's about it for this tutorial don't forget to visit webstarch.com to make your own designer account and start your own uh, web hosting and design firm.